Hey everybody, it's Sabina here from EDM Toronto. I am here with none other than Tritonal, the trans duo from Texas. Right here on the Stella Borealis here in Toronto, celebrating their Toronto debut. Guys, how does it feel for you to start off your first show in Toronto on a rowdy pirate ship? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely is sort of have that rowdy pirate ship feel, doesn't it? The, the place is packed. Um, we're obviously excited to be in our first time in Toronto, um, you know, and I think it's going to be a cool day. It's, we've got a little bit of, you know, cloudy skies, but it's cool weather, and um, I think it'll keep the temperatures down as we're cruising around the lake. What can we look forward to hearing from your forthcoming album? Danny? If you're talking about the Piercing the Quiet remixed album that's just about to hit next month, that's basically a remake of Piercing the Quiet from last year, and we've got a lot of cool artists on there, including um, Super 8 and Tab, Stoneface and Terminal, Raphael Frost, the Steva, the Madison, a whole bunch of guys. But in terms of writing another new album, um, Dave and I have no intention of rushing that or rushing right into a new one. Um, we, we're both of the mindset that when you write an album, you need to have something to say. And when we wrote Piercing the Quiet, we, we definitely had something to say. Like, Ever After, Still With Me, Poem of Angels, we knew in our heads that we wanted these sort of tracks on the album. And right now, we're like experimenting with um, all sorts of new styles and um, different sounds and like really trying to figure out what's new. Like we don't ever want to regurgitate the same track. I think if you listen to track tonal stuff, it's always kind of different and we want to keep that up. So we're not rushing into a new album and we won't until we have something to say. Yeah, right. but we can't be rushed. No, that's <laughs> Let true. our sound advice. Yeah. Sure. For the aspiring producer, what would you say would be the most important thing to pay attention to when, it, when producing a track and maybe any advice for the aspiring novice? You know, just keep your head in the game and don't, you know, get jaded by having to DJ all the time. Mm -hmm. You know, keep your head in the studio, always focus on, you know, your melodies and, and just, you know, day in and day out, just focus on practicing with compression and practicing with EQing. Try, you yeah, know, experiment it. around. Find where your sound is. Definitely know your stuff. That's it. It's and, the and three it, P's, isn't it? It's, it's, it's passion and practice and perseverance. Because yes. if you don't have passion, you're not going to practice enough. And even though you practice, you're going to suck a lot. So you need perseverance to keep getting better. And, and like, we've, if there's any quality that we've had that I think has allowed us to succeed, it's perseverance because so many records, we've, we've written over a hundred records mm -hmm. and most of those haven't been number one beat poured hits. A lot of them have just, nobody cared, you know? And, and right. But we needed to go through that in order to get our productions to where they are today. Excellent, well, words of wisdom, you heard it first. Thank you guys so much <laughs> for taking much. the time for sitting down with yeah, the man. Toronto. No this is Sabino and we are ready to Throw down to try a tonal. <laughs> we'll see you guys Thank soon. You guys. We'll see you guys soon. Bye. <laughs>